lifetutorials.com. Easy to follow, easy to learn, designed to inspire. Hey everyone, my name is Matthew Shaw. Well, this is a creative edit of a macro picture or photo I took of one of my lenses but has some tremendous value in learning how to process this photo or process your Lightroom photos. So stick around and hopefully you can learn some new things. So what you're seeing here is a picture of um, one, of my mac one of my lenses. Uh, basically I'm just first now just setting my crop, making sure that your photos are straight. If your photos are not straight, it really hurts your images. Now what I first did was play with my auto adjustments and then the auto exposure options were too bright. So all I'm doing now is playing and readjusting my settings here, uh, enabling my profile, my lens corrections, certain lenses give distortion on the photos. And then once I've done that, basically going through the different settings, uh, making sure my photo is sharp, making sure that um, I'm also smoothing out, smoothing out any noise and uh, really trying to enhance those colors of that lens. So by default, when you take a picture, the color profile is usually fairly bland in Lightroom, meaning every picture you see is based off a color profile that Lightroom uh, or the camera profile, the camera makers have a profile that is input, input in Lightroom and essentially that profile of color is usually very bland. So all I'm doing right now is basically enhancing the colors of the image to the way I saw them and the way I want them to be and really just enhancing the different elements of the image. If you notice that um, by default many images are very bland and not just colors but also tones. So what I'm doing now is just enhancing the different whites and uh, the yellows and you're seeing sort of a little, little before and after and um, now basically I'm just going through and fixing, I had a really dirty lens. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, I'm just trying to reduce uh, some of the dust that was on the lens because I am zoomed in quite far, so any dust that exists on the lens, you're gonna see it. So what I'm doing right now is using the clone tool and the heal tool just to remove some of that. And then also too, I'm just painting in exposure, meaning I'm painting in darkness to make that section be a little more dark, more crisp, and not have those different uh, discrepancies in color. So that's a quick edit of a macro photo of a lens. Hopefully you learned a couple new things and can see the dramatic difference in the before and after. And uh, hopefully you can apply some of these new edits to your photos and be inspired to edit your own photos. Thanks again. My name is Matthew Shonimal and have a great day. FreeLifeTutorials.com. Easy to follow, easy to learn, designed to inspire.